So yesterday was the um, local village show I was telling you about in the last video. Went along, um, me and the other half put in six exhibits and we done okay. It was a really good show, um, plenty going on, plenty of exhibits, bar, burgers, hot dogs, band. Um, the weather was nice so it was a really good day. So I'd like to say thanks to Little Paxton Parish Council and all the volunteers for putting that show on. Really enjoyed it and I'll definitely be back next year. So um, I'll show you the results of that a little bit later in the video, but first I need to get this bed prepared because I need to get the pack joy out, which is starting to go a little bit yellow because the roots are bursting out of the pots. So um, all that's coming up later. Um, I need to prepare these beds now. I'll bring you along and show you what I'm doing. So this bed here, uh, you can see how much it's sunk at the sweet corn in. What I've literally done is chucked a load of chicken pellets on it. I'm going to give it a really good soak in and then just top it up with some normal peat free compost. Plant pack choy straight into it. So nothing technical. Don't know if it will work. Um, we'll give it a go. We had some good crops last year going in in the cold so we'll see how we get on. It's not bad stuff this. together but it's only an experiment. Need some plants. Pretty decent roots. So I'm pleased with those. Good old bulb planter. Work. It's still quite dry. It's uh, use my hand. Plant them nice and deep. Yeah, so it's still quite dry, and this has had about 50 litres. Lovely roots on them. Looking beautiful.
don't know why I'm using this planter, it's dry. <laughs> We have it, nice row of 10 pack choice. We'll see how they get on. And just to fill the space, I thought I'd whack in a row or two rows of Lolo Rossa lettuces. Turned into a nice little plant seeds. So we'll see how they get on. It's one bed done. A few more to go, but uh, that'll be next week or the week after, guys. There they are, guys, all put to bed. Just got the little uh, hoop netting set up on there. Should give them some form of protection until they get a bit bigger and then it will just come off. Uh, seemed to be fine last year like that, so um, mind you, I've never done pack choy uh, through the autumn, so we'll see how it goes, but I'll do the job for now. So there we go, guys. Pack choy, a few lettuces in, all wrapped up. We'll see how they get on. Uh, I'm going to leave it here today. Well, what I'm going to do, I'm going to leave you a few stills of the um, the show we done yesterday and me and the other half we entered six exhibits and we got five first places and one second place um, I want to thank Amy for helping out doing some of the cooking for us um, all seemed to work so it's all good and to top it all off I won the best in show gold award for fruit and veg so quite chuffed for my first one um, again I'd like to thank uh, the Parish Council for putting it on and all the volunteers, all the people behind the scenes because all the setting up and all that kind of stuff takes time so well done guys, you've put on a great show um, looking forward to it next year so I'll leave you some stills guys of uh, some of the exhibits and the trophy and I'll see you soon so these are the show carrots guys, the chosen ones they're not perfect but they're a really good size uh, and we have got some stumps not brilliant but um, I think they're in with a chance they're pretty good carrots good size, nice and clean so we'll see how we get on